Hi, so um, I'm recording a video to, to show how to enable the, the timer only when uh, the throttle is active on, uh, on the cutoff. Okay, when it's cut off, even if you move the throttle, the timer doesn't go up. If we active it, it's out of cutoff, so it, the, the throttle is active now. Okay, it stopped. As soon as we move the throttle, it start counting. And for example, I'll try to cut off and the timer will stop. So I think it's pretty much this that the uh, Willy Feltman has asked uh, on the Jumper T12 T16 transmitter community. And I'll, I'll show you how to do this. So go into the settings and uh, this is the last step so uh, we will create a logic switch and we will assign the logic switch uh, in this case for timer 1 which is can be assigned for timer 2 or 3 doesn't matter so <coughs> I'm going back okay logic switch so and uh, I, I think I don't have to uh, to, to do it again. Uh, I ju I'm just showing the how the setup is done. So, uh, but uh, I can replicate it here just to see how how, how it, it is done. So uh, let's do the same on Logic Two. So scroll until you reach the. Uh, an empty uh, logic switch line okay select it and uh, the cursor will jump for the the first option select again and look for a like this okay it's uh, a bigger than X okay select jump to the next one <coughs> And the first variable uh, will, will be throttle, the, the throttle stick, okay, it, uh, it's this symbol here, this is the symbol of a stick or potentiometer, throttle. Okay, let's uh, look for it, aileron, elevator, throttle, okay, <clears throat> so this means that when throttle Okay, when throttle it's bigger, it's bigger than this value. So, assuming that uh, the range goes from minus 100 to 100 and zero, it's the the neutral point. So, uh, for a, for an airplane, for example, where the 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 cutoff position is on on the bottom, I go all the way down. And uh, this position here, it's minus 100. Okay, that's why I've put on uh, minus 90, which means that the, the throttle has to move, need, needs to move a little bit. You can put uh, minus 95, minus minus 90. Uh, you have to check on your uh, on your system to, to see what uh, what suits you best. Okay, what's the the best value for this? So when throttle goes, it's bigger than 95, and the switch, the throttle, uh, the throttle cut switch, it's on the arming, on the arming position. Okay. The sentence ends here. So when the throttle, it's bigger than minus 95, and the cutoff switch it's an arming position or armed position okay what will it do is it will do what will it do Let's 
call let's call the logic switch two that we have just created here so when the throttle is uh, bigger than uh, minus 95 and the switch is on arm position it will activate the timer too okay so let's uh, this is pretty easy to to do okay and now let's create another timer okay set up with the with get timer timer two back 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 okay so again it is on arm position throttle down not moving i move just a little notch and it will start move okay it's moving it's moving all the way up it's keep moving keep counting up and even if i if i have the throttle up if i cut the throttle down it will stop the timer well i think um, that's what you need uh, for your specific uh, radio um, I hope it uh, it was uh, it was helpful. So, see you on the next one. Cheers.